Hello my darlings, I hope you're all doing very very well, I hope you're all sitting comfortably or you're laying comfortably, you are feeling cosy. In today's video I am just introducing myself to the ASMR world. Um, I have a normal channel or my main channel where I mainly talk about tattoos. I have been doing that since around about 2015, 2016, but it's been my full-time job since 2018, in the middle of 2018. And um, yeah, I just normally talk about tattoos and everything that comes along with being tattooed and you know, the pros and the cons, and talking about great artists. Um, I've done one ASMR video on that channel, and that was reacting to um, TikToks that were tattoo related, but were on the ASMR scale, if that makes any sense. Um, but I've always been intrigued by ASMR. It's something that I some what enjoy it, it's kind of i it's it's kind of embarrassing i would say to admit you enjoy smr because there's somewhat of this stigma around asmr a lot of people think it's you know for naughty reasons i don't know yes i don't know there's a few things that i love within asmr one of my favorite ones is um people drawing on iPads. There's this ASMR channel that I love to watch so, so much and they just draw these amazing works of art on their iPad and it's more of a, I would say, comfort thing. It's more relaxing and entertaining, you know, it's quite soothing. It's kind of like listening to, you know, rain. You know, some people listen to rain tracks when they're falling asleep or whatever, it's kind of like that. Um, other ASMRs I love so much are um, hairdressing ASMRs or hair play ASMRs or hair brushing ASMRs. I love that so so much and like scalp checks but I can't watch the ones where people have taken it so far where they put stuff in their, you know, mannequin head, you know, like it looks infested, um, that creeps me out a little bit, so, yeah, um, I also love tapping, oh my gosh, I love tapping ASMRs and just like, noises like that, oh, I love it so much, again, it's more of a calming thing for me, and yeah, it just puts my mind at ease a little bit, you know, it's just something to concentrate on that isn't heavy or something you have to think about, you know, because my mind is always racing, oh my goodness, my mind is always racing, so I need something to just calm me down, you know, just something soothing. So I really wanted to have a go at ASMR. It's probably going to be a difficult one for me um, because I suffer with this condition, TMI, um, where I can't burp. So I make these very obnoxious loud hiccup noises and I've noticed with a lot of ASMR videos there isn't many jump cuts. There is minimal cutting and that is very hard for someone like me who makes a lot of noise um so i apologize if there is jump cuts within my videos uh it's just the noises i make are not very asmr friendly so i've always thought i would struggle making asmr because i have thought about it for a while um and it's yeah it's it's a it sounds weird and probably not like a serious thing to live with but 
trust me, there are days where I struggle to be alive because of it. And uh, that sounds so dramatic, I know. But not being able to burp, it's so uncomfortable. Oh my gosh, I cannot even explain. Um, but anyway, um, so we're going to see how I get along with this. I would love your feedback on this and, you know, whether I should even attempt to do ASMR because of that. Because of the fact that there might be uh, quite a few jump cuts here and there. But yeah, the kind of ASMR videos that I would love to make is stuff like this where I'm just sitting down talking about like my favourite things, tapping on things, maybe a couple of role plays here and there. I've got one idea for a role play, which is like Big Sister helps you with your tattoo aftercare. I feel like that would be a really cool like role play ASMR for me to do, considering that the majority of my normal content is tattoo related so i'd like to take my tattoo related stuff over to the asmr world a little bit um not too much though because i know some of my regular audience doesn't like asmr and what have you and i don't want them to feel like they're missing out on content if that makes sense because they don't like asmr i don't know um but yeah i'd love to do you know tapping on stuff like this you know, like, ooh. <laughs> it's like, I just love that noise so much, you know? So, like, tapping on stuff that's my favourite thing, like my perfume bottles, jewellery, um, hairbrushes. Oh my gosh, I love the sound of hairbrushes. I don't know why. <laughs> and, um, yeah, just doing the usual ASMR things, I guess. But there's so many talented ASMR artists out there that I don't think I'll ever compare to them. You know, it's a very frightening thing starting something new. Because it's been a very, very long time since I started my first channel. I've kind of forgotten what it feels like to be new at something um, when it comes to YouTube. Because I've been doing it for a while. So I'm like starting off from scratch again and it's a whole new world, <laughs> especially with something that I've never really done before, ever. Um, but yeah, I would love to know what kind of ASMR videos you like, what is something you enjoy watching within ASMR. Um, it could be literally everything. <laughs> I'm willing to try anything I would say. Um, Apart from eating ones, I'm not a fan of eating ASMR just because the sound of people eating makes me a little bit angry. Not completely, but I've noticed with a lot of ASMR eating videos, people are very, very obnoxious with it. And I, I just cannot take part in that. Um, I mean, if the requests are there, you know, your girl loves to eat, so I'd be happy to do it, I guess. I don't know, I don't know. It's a bit of a weird one for me. I don't know if I could edit a video of me chowing down on food. You know, I, I, I don't know, I don't, yeah. Um, but yeah, I'm not for attempting to do roleplay videos, but there's a part of me that might not be able to take myself too seriously with that. Um, so I think it's best if I keep it to stuff I know. You know, I can't really roleplay being a teacher because I'm not a teacher. There's no way. <laughs> um, but, ooh, I have a perfume bottle here. Um, but yeah, I'd love to do videos on stuff that I collect, so that is perfume, Halloween decorations, that's about it to be honest. Lipstick, I have a lot of lipsticks and candles, oh my goodness I love candles so, so much. It's, <laughs> it's a sickness, every season I have to stock up on um, different candles, so you know, for autumn, <laughs> I own a lot of candles. And, um, yeah, <laughs> I 
I'm sure if you uh, watched my main channel, you would have seen my Halloween hauls. And I buy, I, I buy a lot of candles. It's, um, but yeah, I love ASMR videos like that when people are just talking about their favourite things. Again, it's it's a mixture of listening to people talk about stuff they love, and you can hear their like a passion for it. And then of course the added noises. You know, so I could just sit here and talk about this gorgeous candle that I have, which is this English toffee, and it smells so delicious. Oh my goodness, I cannot even explain. Oh, that's so nice. And the uh, wax there is black, which is to my aesthetic. You know, Halloween aesthetic. Um, but yeah, so oh, just put that on there like that. Okay. So yeah, I would absolutely love to know the kind of ASMR videos you enjoy, um, what you don't enjoy, and I'm gonna see if there's the consensus there. You know, see what the majority like and don't like. Um, but yeah, I want to make this a very safe space for everyone to feel comfortable and safe. You know, that's kind of what I do with my main channel as well. I don't like people to feel left out or anything like that, so, because, yeah, the world is horrible and scary as it is. So everyone needs a bit of comfort now and then, of course. And, um, yeah, so I just wanted to, uh, do this video to introduce myself and to say hello. Um, again, my name is Lauren, um, or you can call me Treacle, I don't mind, whichever one is um, beneficial for you. <laughs> and I'm just here to have some fun and enjoy myself and make different content and mix things up a bit. You know, it's fun to do different things sometimes. So, I would just want to say hello, and, um, yeah. <laughs> I also like nail tapping, I don't know if you can tell that. Such a nice noise. I recently got my nails done for, um, Halloween. I don't know if you can tell, but I very much like Halloween. I'm in my filming room here, um, which I decorated recently. If you want to see the uh, process of that, I do have a vlog on it. It won't be ASMR, of course. Um, but yeah, I recently did just get my nails done for Halloween. If I can show you, I don't know. <laughs> um, but I have the screen mask on two of the fingers there. And then the rest of the fingers have black and orange for Halloween. And then hopefully these will um, grow out eventually, as they do. And then when I get my next infill, I'm hoping that it will be beginning of October, middle of October, so I can have another Halloween set. That's why I've done Halloween nails so early, so I can have two sets of Halloween nails this year. <laughs> um, yeah, I love Halloween. I don't know if you can tell. I have a pumpkin witch tattoo here. I have a lot of horror Halloween themed tattoos because that's just my aesthetic um, yeah I've always loved Halloween the first time I watched a horror film oh my goodness I was pretty young I think the first horror film I ever saw was The Blair Witch Project or it could have been The Craft I now have a tattoo dedicated to my love of the film The Craft. Um, but yeah, I like horror films and thrillers and spooky stuff. I like the not so scary stuff as well. You know, like Hocus Pocus and all of that stuff. It just gives me a very warm, comfy feeling. So yeah, I think that'll be it for today. For this ASMR video, I hope I've done okay. I would love absolutely any feedback you can give me. Um, 
literally anything. So I'm going to say goodbye for now. I highly, highly appreciate you all so, so much. Um, thanks for being here. Thanks for watching. Until my next one. Bye.